Hello, you guys. Thanks for coming back to my channel. This is Sheba, and I do have my week number nine money challenge that's hosted by Cat and Paws. And then I do have a small Michaels and Holla haul that I want to share with you guys. So I want to explain first what the money challenge is all about. What it is, it started, it was like I said, it's hosted by Cat and Paws. It started on December 29th of last year, and it goes all the way up until the Friday, which I don't know the date. But it goes all the way up until the Friday of this year after Thanksgiving. At the end of the money challenge, you will have saved up $600. So what do you do is you, on a piece of paper or, I just clipped out some circles with my punch, circle punch. Um, you do clip out four, or a 48 scrap, you know, piece of paper or whatever you want to use. You're going to do have 48 of these. So you're going to have a, one side, one through 24, and then another one through 24, which is going to be a total of 48. And every week, you just put it in a box or whatever you want to use. You put all your paper, your papers in here, like in a box, and you uh, pull a number. And you pull a number every week. And whatever you pull, so if I pull $12 this week, I will put up $12. And then next Friday, I'll do the same all up until the Friday after Thanksgiving. And once you get to that date, the Friday after Thanksgiving, whatever that date is, you will have saved up $600. And that $600 can be used for whatever you want to use it for. I'm going to use mine for Christmas shopping, for family and friends. So that is what the money challenge is. So I just want to explain that because I had you know, people comment and asking about it and thought it was interesting. So I said, well, when I do my next video, I will explain to you guys what the money challenge is. So I'm going to go ahead and get ready to pull for week number nine. So let me just get my little box of quick shake. And I hope I explained that well. And I also hope everyone had a pretty good week. It is Friday. The weekend has a, a come upon us. And I'm so, so happy. So for week number nine, I'm going to put up $19. So that is my challenge for week nine. So I'll put my cash back in here. I'll put my numbers. And I'll put that in here as well once I write it down. I'm just going to put this to the side for right now. I will write it down my little handy book so I don't get my weeks and my what I have put up saved mixed up. So I'll put that in this book here. So I'm going to go ahead and show you guys real quick what I purchased from Holler. So what I purchased from Holler, I did um, get this Craft Medley 9.8 foot stretch craft cord. It's the color mix. It's purple, red, teal, blue, and yellow. And so I'm going to eventually try my hand at trying to make me a journal or a junk journal. Uh, Tammy from My World in OKC, which also has a channel. Most of you all know her. She had, she We live in the same uh, area, same state, uh, same city. And um, she had sent me a picture this morning of her junk journal that she made. And it was very, very pretty. So... Not knowing that I was going to get this, you know, get these cords here. She didn't know, but I'm going to also get some white ones as well. But I thought I would give these try uh, when I give, try to do a junk journal or a traveler's notebook or whatever. So, got one of those, a pack of those. All these stickers here are from Forever in Time. And this is the vintage uh, craft stickers. And this will be really cute for a junk journal um, if you're doing a vintage look. So this is the like uh, sewing one, the scissors, the spool of thread, the hanger, the sewing machine, the zipper. Really, really cute. It's like a uh, newspaper on the backing. It's like newspaper print. I'm sorry. Some of them have like a like the sewing machine has like a newspaper print on it. So that's what that looks like. Sorry about that glare. And then this one's the same way, but this is like the uh, coffee, the tea time. It's coffee time. The teapot's got a little tag and the fork and fork and spoon. It looks like that. Thought that was really cute. And then I also got the love, and it's got the heart and the lips and the key. And this looks like that. Really cute. And then I also got two packs of this because one is for some friend mail. And I thought these were really cute. These are the coffee cups. That looks like that. Got the mustache on that one. The bird. Thought these were really cute. And then I got the umbrella with the cloud. And it's got like the raindrops. It's like a, like a, I don't know, it's like a puffy sticker. Not really, well, I don't know. But it's 
really, really cute. I know I keep saying cute, because it is, it's cute. And that's what that looks like. And then the last one is these birthday hats, and it's got the little palm, and it's got like the pipe cleaner. Yeah, like the pipe cleaner at the bottom. The trim of the hat. And that's also cute. So, that is my quick little holler haul that I purchased from Holler. And then I also purchased from Michaels today. But I did order this from Michaels and I got this in the mail today. And this is the um, Mambi, um, uh, Mambi one and a half by 2.4 inch wiggly box punch for your happy planner. And I've been wanting one of these since I've seen Kendra 504 Pretty Things, who also has a channel. She has showed this on Instagram. And so I finally broke down and got me one. And so I got it today. And it looks like this. So if you haven't seen it, the little lid, plastic lid just pops up. That's where you get your paper out of. And then, of course, this is your punch part. So I'm just going to take a piece of paper here and just punch so I can just kind of show you guys what it looks like. So you put your paper in like that. And then you just push the lever down, and you just flip the little lid up, and you get your paper out. And so that's what it looks like. So it fits your planner perfectly. I did purchase a recollection planner, which I'm not really happy about. I just don't be consistent with it. When I had my happy planner, I was very consistent. So in July, when they come up with the new planners or before, I will purchase me another happy planner. And that's what I'm going to stick with, because I do like the happy planner. So, I just want to share with you guys what I got and just give you a quick little review on how that works, if you don't know. And then I also, because my enabler, which is Vivacious V, she had told me today when I was leaving the Dollar Tree, I was talking to her, and she told me that she had went to Michael's and they had their three tubes of washi for $15. So, you got three tubes of washi for $15, you guys. So, I had to go to Michael's and get this. I had to go see what was going on. And yes, I did get three tubes of washi again for $15, which are normally $14.99 each. So I'm going to show you the ones that I purchased. And these are some of the ones I've been wanting for a while. So this one here is the unicorn. And it says it's the little things. And then it's got the, um, what is this? The uh, silver full washi, I think that is. And then it's got the pink washi with the unicorn, the hearts, some more full washi, and then the unicorn at the very bottom. So I thought that was very, very pretty. I'm trying to get this glare out the way so you guys can see it. So that's what that one looks like. And then this one here is the mermaid one that says, Shell, yeah, um, laugh, swim, love, uh, make waves. And I think this was really cute with the mermaid. It looks like that. You can see it. And then the last one I got is the llama. And it says... Um, Dang it, dang it feels good to be a llama. <laughs> and then it says, save the llama for your drama. And then it's got some butterflies and some lace trim washi and stuff like that. Really, really pretty. And I'm not really a llama person, but you know, it's cute. So I got that one. And then I also purchased these two stamps from the Valentine collection. And these were normally $2.00. And they were 40 cents each. So I got the uh, unicorn. You have the unicorn with the hearts. And then I also got the Love You A Latte with the coffee cup. So I went ahead and purchased those. And then I also purchased, this is by Craft Smart, and this is the gold uh, coffee cup, six piece. And they this was $2. And then I also purchased the Craft Smart stamp set. And it's the mermaid. It's 11 pieces. And it says, let's celebrate and be a mermaid. It's got the little die cut mermaid at the top there. So I got this pack. And they have many more. But I went here and just kind of contained myself, you guys. Because I went in there for this washi. So that is all that I do have for my hauler and my Michaels haul. I do want to thank you all so much for watching. I do thank you all for subscribing. All my new subscribers for being a part of my channel. If you're not a subscriber, I hope that you hit that subscribe button. That little bell to be notified of my upcoming videos. And I also thank all of my current subscribers. So thank you all so much for that. And until my next video, I will talk to you guys later. Bye-bye.